So let's say I'm visiting France. No, you're visiting France. I'm visiting France. Yes. Okay. So, okay. so we are saying we are both alone in the kitchen. Okay. Uh, so. I wish I could get the hands so that they don't dangle down like that. But I don't know how I can't to get do them in. This one's a bit, they're quite small, the little thing to put the things in, aren't they? The bigger in this one. Yeah. I'll try. Okay. Hello, hello, everybody. Do you know who I am? Who are you? It's my aunt. It's my, my niece. It's my hey, aunt. what are you doing here then? I'm on holiday, visiting family. Well, it's about time you never even looked after your father. That's not true. Yes, it is. I did in, 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 in heart and mind, I did. Well, you should be here looking after him like all the others did, shouldn't you? Did you look after him? Well, of course I was there every week. Really? Huh. Um, were you kind? It shows that you're never there. You don't even do your duty of a good daughter. That's not very nice. Well, what's this outfit you're wearing? Is that dress too short or what? No, it's a special dress from England. Well, they can't even dress over there. They dress like shit. And it makes me really tall, so huh. I'm taller than you. Well, no, you're not, because I'm taller than you, really. Well, I'm afraid you're not. That's not true, because I'm 1 meter 70 and you're only 1 meter 65. <laughs> anyway, what are you doing here then? I've come to see my brothers and my sister and my aunts. Well, you've come to see me then? Yes, I have come to see you. Well, I don't want to see you. That's I'm not, not interested. I'm doing the cooking. That's not right. Well, that's why are you so unkind to me? What do you mean unkind? You've I welcome you like I welcome my niece, as I've always done. Well, you do it in a very cold and loving way. Well, that's because I don't like you. Isn't it visible? Well, why don't you like me? What for, what for done to you? Well, ask your therapist why I don't like you. I've asked him and he said to ask you, because you're the problem, not the therapist. So tell me why. What for done to, what for done to hurt you? must be a reason, you must know why. Are, are you unhappy? Well, you should know. You were such a stupid child. No, I'm not. I'm not stupid. I'm kind. You're stupid and you would never help anyone. That's not true. And you never say hello when you come into the kitchen. I could say hello. Well, today you did, yes. What's wrong with not saying hello? I want respect. respect I walk. want to be respected. Every time someone comes in, I need to be acknowledged. You expect me to walk in here to see my aunts who have known since I was a baby, and you expect me to say hello when you've been mean to me all my life? Of course so. I'm your aunt and I deserve respect. Well, you don't have my respect because you've been mean to me all my life for no reason. I'm, I, I was a young girl and you were mean to me. Oh, you just talk nonsense, so, absolutely nonsense. You think it's right for an adult to, to, to be mean to a child? To a, young, so. to a young girl? If the child is bloody stupid, it won't get out of its bedroom, it's reading all the time, it never helps, it never says a word, and it adds, it's, pretends to be scared when I'm around. Well, I'm a child. I'm a ch I was a child reading my horse books. Do you blame me wanting to stay in my room and read my horse books when I've got you, who've been unkind to me for so long? I've never been unkind to you. All the clothes I've bought you, all these Christmas presents, all this holiday at the mountains, doing skiing with your sister, and I never got to thank you for it. I just say thank you. Well, just now. Yes. But I expect to respect you and say thank you when you're unkind to me. It's not good enough. Taking me on holiday isn't what I want. I wanted you to be kind to me and show me some love as you're my family, you're my aunt. I can't do fucking love, that's for pussies. Really? Yeah. You must be a very unhappy lady 
I'm happy, look at me, I've mm -hmm. got money, I travel, I've got lots of friends, everybody loves me. Well, I don't, I don't, because you've been mean to me all my well, life. Good job, then you're in England and you never come to see us anyway. Well, I left because I had my reasons. Eh, hey, what reasons I, are that? Well, you were one of them. To me? To escape from you, being unkind. Why would you be unkind to a, a little girl? You should well, be ashamed of yourself. What have you done to your hand? Is that a nail missing there on your right hand? It's a little bit of dis uh, discomfort. It's toenail fungus on your hands. Aren't you doing something about that? Have you seen the doctor? Yes, I have. And so? Well, that's nothing to do with you because you've got no kind words to me. Why should I talk to you about it? All you do is criticise me. Well, it's not very pretty looking. And you think you're pretty, do you? You, you might be pretty on the outside, but you're not pretty on the inside, are you? Of but course I am pretty. Yeah. Everybody likes me. I've got lots of friends and like you. You think people like you, but you're delusional, aren't you? Look at you. Look in, look in the mirror. Ha! Ha! You're, you're not happy. And look you're... at those toenails. What have you done on your toes? My toes? Oh, it's a toenail... You've got athletic foot on your toes. Nothing wrong with my toes. And you've got spots as well. It's disgusting. No, it's not. Haven't you seen a doctor for that? Yes, I have. And that's well, you should be bloody taking better care of yourself. Well, maybe if you'd shown some love towards me when I, was, uh, when I was younger and now, maybe I wouldn't have it. Maybe you're the cause. Maybe it was you. Huh. Blaming me for your physical problems when you're obviously neglecting yourself. Well, maybe I do neglect myself. When you don't get any love or family, especially you, what do you expect? You've made me suffer all these years of your unloving manner towards me. Huh, the only thing you loved was those stupid chickens anyway. I love those chickens. I not, killed I, them all. Well, you will, redemption will get you. Huh, redemption, yes, don't even will. believe in yes, this Catholic well, yes, bullshit. It, yes, it will. Karma will get you. Calm, how was that? You've got you've got ugly insides. And those chickens, one chicken is worth a hundred of you. I love those chickens. You shouldn't have killed them. Huh, I'm pretty glad I did too. Well... You're just a waste of space. No, no I'm not. No, I'm not. I look at that dress. This they dress, can't even dress this, those English dress, people. This, is my, this dress I made my own, with my own hands and my, and my own thread and my own needles. Huh. I don't go to some silly posh shop and buy some designer clothes which make me feel better. I don't need I don't need to spend silly amounts of money on a dress to make me feel good. And like look, look at you. You look like a look like a Mars bar. Mars bar? Yes. Covered in lipstick. I've got so the it's... best dress and the best mascara on the market. Well, it looks a bit does not right well. It might make you feel beautiful, but are you really beautiful inside? I've and got beautiful green eyes. Look at them. Beautiful. Green looks like outside. looks like looks like pond weed to me. Pond weed. Yes, pond. Auntie pond weed, you are. You can't get out of this house. You're not welcome here. I would welcome wherever I want to be welcome. M mean old lady, aren't you? You're just a little kid. You've never grown up. You've never taken any responsibilities. Yes. And look at you I've at 45. You're not even married. You've no children. Well, don't have to be I married. I should be quiet about that. I've no children nor married myself. But you should be married and you should have children and you should have a better situation than the one you're in. Look at you renting a place. You haven't even got, from what I'm here, from because you keep telling all your YouTubers that you have no fucking money. Well, that's not very good of yourself, is it? I don't care what you say to me. The words don't hurt me. Well, at this point, I expect you to start crying, I'm not my gonna dear. Cry. I'm not going to cry because I'm strong and you can't hurt me anymore. Can you? But crying is all you knew how to do when you were little. Well, as and a, as an adult. I was a little girl and I was hurt. And you, sh you should not make little girls cry. You should be ashamed of yourself. Ashamed when I've done so much for you what? and the trips in Toulouse when you came to see me and me knocking at the bathroom door saying how long are you going to be in this shower you know I'm paying the water and the heat can you get out now
Well, you should be patient and wait your turn. That's no. Polite, that's polite manners. As a French lady, where are your French manners? Have you not got any? My manners are that when someone visits me, they do not spend any more than 5 minutes 30 seconds in the shower. That is just known. Everybody knows it. Nobody else spends any longer in the shower. In England, we're in the shower for 6 minutes 37 seconds. So there. Oh, well, I have no, nothing to say to that. The English don't know how to live. They don't know how to economise money. They just throw it over the roofs, over the windows. And we have special water, which has been made of a wand. Have you got a wand? No, you haven't. A wand? That's what's this bullshit now. It's not bullshit. Cl what's this magic wand? Tell me more. It, it, stru it structures water and, and makes it special and magic and heals you. Oh, yes. And what does science say about well, that? Well, science says a lot of things about it, actually. It's sci scientifically proven. If you actually drank it yourself, maybe it'd make you a nicer person and not a miserable old lady. Huh. In Those a, things don't even work. In a posh dress. You've or, always, you're wasting your money again. You're so profligate. It's Look at you, you've wasted your parents' money, you've wasted your own money. You're just a failure. You are a failure. Look at your toes, they're disgusting. You my should be ashamed Well, my yourself. toes are beautiful. What's, what's the definition of beautiful? What do you know about beauty? Look at you, ugly lady. <laughs> Look at you. And you've got a beard, haven't you? Beard lady. Eh. <laughs> Beard. I do know. I, I go to the laser every week to the aesthetician and she plucks every one of my hair. I have not a hair in sight on my face. I've, I've been told that you've got a really hairy bum like a monkey. Is that true? Is it? Of course not. Monkey bottom? No. Are you auntie monkey bottom? The aesthetician plucks that as well. Really? Yes, because I go to nature's camps. I feel sorry for that person who plucks it. They must be feel they must feel really sick afterwards. You're just being mean and stupid. Ah, that's how you act towards me, isn't it? A taste of your own medicine. Oh. How does that how does that feel? Who's given me such a stupid niece? Who's given me such a stupid dragon aunt? You think you're better than me, you're not better than me of at all. Of course I am. I had a proper career, you know. Carry. I was a civil servant in so the army. I'm a chocolatier and my chocolate is is loved by a huge amount of people. Yeah, you'll tell me next as a queen had some, yeah, right. She I bet she even never went near that box you sent the her. Queen had, the queen had some and she loved it. What do you know about the queen anyway? Ah, she's dead. Or drag anyway. No, we don't want a queen in France. We chop their heads off. Well, you've got silly Macron, you. Huh? You deserve Macron, you do. Look, I voted for Macron, so the right wing wouldn't get in. And now look at where we are. But I don't care because I'm retired. I don't get my pension. Well, but are you happy? Are you really happy? I am happy. No. I travel all over the world. On, on, on I make people miserable. I criticize them all day long with my high pitch voice. And where's that got you, eh? Lonely and sad. Whereas I have a happy life with my own business and with some nice friends. What have you got? Just money and nothing else. I've got your family, the one you disowned and the one you never go and see. Well, because you don't love them anymore, do, do you? I do love them. I love all of them. And if you actually spoke to me in a decent civil manner, Maybe you'd, you'd actually know what's in my head, but as it is, you make all these assumptions about me, and you don't know me. You've not tried to know me. Of course I know you don't be stupid and this thing about changing your name. Or you, uh, that's what's the... wrong with your name that your parents gave you at birth? Oh. Why didn't you want to keep that? Because I didn't like it, and Alexandra is a beautiful name, and it makes me feel good. And I have a right to change my name. Well, no, you haven't. Yes, you should accept with grace what... Your parents have given you and not change it. Well, I, I decided to change it and it's, it's me, not my parents. And my parents would, would not mind if I changed my name. All they wanted me to, to be was to be happy. That's not true. No, they wanted you to be successful and be very rich. Well, I'm successful. And what, what's the definition of rich to you? Eh? A big purse? Well, it's not, is it? I have a good heart and a kind heart. What have you got? A shriveled up... Mouldy one. 
Ah, but a big heart. Non, I'm non. so generous. I always bring fruits and oysters and smoked salmon to all the parties I go to. Boxes of dates, boxes of the best chocolates, cakes from the best boulanger. And you dare me say that I am ungrateful and ungenerous. Well, you do have to buy, to buy you, you're doing all that to, to buy people's friendship, aren't you? Of course not. Yes, you are. Be honest. It's yourself. just who I am. I'm a generous, kind person. So, you're not kind to me, are no, you? No, that's because you don't deserve it. Look at you. I'm a beautiful young woman who's got a successful business. You, you just don't know me. You just make assumptions about me, don't you? Well, I've tried of chocolate. It's actually quite nice. In fact, if I do remember rightly, I sent you 30 euro once to thank you for your chocolates. I remember, and that's one of the few times you've actually shown kindness and love towards me. Well, I don't know about love, but I uh, sort of felt obliged at the time. Well, you could give me a... You could be more kind towards me, couldn't you? You could give me a nice... You could give me a little hug and make up for all the pain you've, and suffering you've caused me for your neglect and un unloving manner. But we don't do hugs in France, you know, that We just kiss hello without well, meaning it. Well, what's, what's the point in that? Well, the point is we pretend we like each other. Well, I don't want to pretend with anyone. I want to be real. Why pretend? What is the point in pretending to be real? The point in pretending is that it looks to everybody that everything is going all right. And we keep a sort of order in the family line. Well, that's, that's fake, isn't it? Where's the honesty in that? There's no need for honesty or the than... When something's wrong, we say it. Look at your toes, they're disgusting. My toes are beautiful. I know lots of people who think my toes are beautiful. and I don't care what you think. Your toes are not beautiful. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. You're just self-delusioned. No, I'm not. You need to go and see a doctor. What has these spots around here? Why are you just keep peeling? You're so mean, you are. All you do is criticise, and why is that? Because you... That's because I love you and because I care for you. You think you actually think you do that? Of course I do. That's the only reason why I criticise you. Because my love for you is so immense. You think so? Yes. Are you looking at your toes? No, I'm giving my face a little stroke because it makes make me feel better. Because I'm shocked. ridiculous. Because I'm shocked that you said that you care for me and that you love me. Of course I do. But why don't, why don't you show it towards me? Because uh, it's the only way I can show it to well, you is by criticising you because you're a stupid little kid who's never grown up and never taken any responsibility in her life. Yes, I have. I've survived on my own for, since I left France. Uh, no one's help on my own. Look at you sabotaging yourself all day long, not being able to work when you've said to yourself you were going to work, wasting time on the internet answering comments on YouTube. Don't you think I know everything about you? Well, that's my choice. I do, because I've got a stalker in your computer and he tells me everything you're doing. It's my choice to do what, to do what if I want to suffer, I shall suffer. And you've made me suffer. Well, you're very stupid if you want to suffer. Well, that's my choice, not yours. I have my reasons. But you've not helped, have you? Hmm. With your mean comments. And your hairy bottom. Which you're in denial about. My bottom? Yes, it's like a monkey's it's bottom, isn't it? beautiful. Well, you think it is, it's not Men really. think it is, unlike you, has been single for the last six years that's or my, three years. That's my choice to be single. Uh, no man wants you, it's because of your toes. No, that's not true at all. Lots of men like me. Well... They want you with the uh, lights off. <laughs> yeah, you, think, you think it's funny, do you? That's not funny. <laughs> yes, of course it is funny. But it's not funny to me. Look at you, you have to wear gloves in bed. <laughs> no, that's, no, that's, my, that's my choice. That's my choice. Well, rubber gloves. <laughs> you can laugh all you want, but they're my gloves and I go on to wear them in bed and I, it's my life, I do what I want. No one tells me what to do. Well, you should be going to the doctors anyway. Well, You're just I, neglecting yourself. I, I do. Your mother would want me to say that. She'd say, go to the doctor. I, I go to the doctor. I go to doctors, to different types of doctors. And they just give you cream, which isn't good, doesn't do you any good. So I go to alternative doctors. Yes, they don't do anything. Yes. They don't even cure you, do you? Well, they will, they will cure me. Because I have hope and I have faith. And I, if I listen to your comments all day long, I'll probably be living in a wormhole. But I'm strong, stronger than you are. Look at you in your fancy dress. I saw your eyes a fancy dress and a coat hanger. 
My dress is beautiful. Oh, look at mine, look at my dress, look at my dress, look at it. You think you're beautiful, look at me, my long oh, hair. Beautiful, beautiful. You think you're beautiful, you're not. I'm more beautiful than you are, look at me. I'm having mm. a bit of fungus, but it's my fungus and not yours. God, good thank God for that. And I'll tell you what I'll do, I'm going to touch you and give it to you. Beep. Oh! There you Don't go. even there touch you me, you're you disgusting. No, I'm not. I'm beautiful. You're repulsive anyway, you've just... No, I'm beautiful. Interrupting me, I'm making dinner. You're going to burn it like you do normally? No, because I cook very well. Well, I, the last time I had some of your food, it, I was actually sick. <laughs> in, in my shoe, because I was so embarrassed. Because I had to hide your toes. Yes. And it worked, so bugger off, you old fanny arms. <laughs> Hi. Uh, Crying, are we? Uh, I can be mean too, but I'm nah, not mean. I just had a, a weakness for a second. I don't do crying. I've well, never cried maybe, in my life. Maybe if you did cry, maybe you might feel a bit more like yourself and not your fake self. What but do you mean, fake self? Well, look at you. You're like a plastic rabbit, aren't you? What do you mean? I've not even had plastic surgery. Well, I'm like all these stupid people with too much money. Well, why have you got rubber fingers? You've had rubber fingers transplants, haven't you? Well... Are you tra trans? Trons. trons? Are you trons? You mean Transylvanian? Transylvanian vampires. That's why you're so mean, because you want my blood, don't you? Is that true? Of course are it you is. A vamp are you a, are you a, a ah. I've always wanted your blood. I know, I know. You shouldn't have been born. Oh, I I've told your mother not to have you. My mother loved me. No, she didn't. She had too much to do already with four children. Well, she loved, She still loved me and she's, she's, still, she's looking down and loving me now. And my oh, father well, she is. doesn't love you. She never loved you. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. Just say nobody ever loved you yes. anyway. Yes, it's not true. Lots of people love me. Look at me. I'm magical. Huh. You're not. You're just a cowpat. Aren't you? Dragon cowpat arms. Your monkey bottom. Enough of that. I'm going out to the kitchen now. Ah, you can't cope, can you? Bye. You can't taste your own medicine. Wow, it's strong, isn't it? You're doing very well. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, sorry.